Good morning guys. So I got my brush and my little cup. As you can see what's inside, that's those are uh, Edamoya pollen and anthers. Now you want the little pollen that's on the, the side there. Those little anthers are the little, I don't know what you call it. They look like little hair. See them? And then I'm taking the pollen those are from the female flower, or the male flower, sorry. And then I just take my little brush and I just lightly brush the female flower. I, ha I made videos of it. You can check in my on my channel on how to pollinate. I think I've gone through it multiple times. So here is the female flower. I just pollinated here I clip one of the petals so I know that it's pollinated and then later on it turns to a male flower I'll collect the pollen from it so now is the time today's uh let me see today's eight uh April 19th and these flowers are starting to get mature and bloom and I've missed some of them as you can see over here we have a nice male flower that I didn't pollinate when it was a female stage right here so this is a male flower Right here. So I'll collect pollen from it after I'm done here. Because I can't do it with one hand. So I usually go around every morning. Around 8 o'clock. And then I'll go again later on at 5 o'clock p.m. To look for any straggler. That I didn't pollinate. See this one? I didn't pollinate. Yeah, all the petals are intact. So this one will uh, dry out and just fall. Let's go through. I like here. These one are gonna open soon. So you gotta be, uh, keep an eye every day. You don't wanna miss your chances on, on uh, potential fruits. See, I did one here. So I can just go ahead and just break this off. And you'll know it, and you'll know it uh, take if the fruit stays on. Here's one right here. These are my Taiwanese. Taiwanese sugar apple. See the flower? These flowers look like the sugar apple. So I'm excited to see what they look like when the fruit develops. Yeah, you can see a little graph union right there. So this will be my first year getting fruit from this scion branch that I got from uh, JD Choi. So we'll see how it looks and compare. Yeah, it's just the beginning. Those are all the flowers I've gotten so far. I've collected the male pollen and now just looking out for, for female flowers to pollinate.
huge difference from my last video, right guys? Remember I show you how I prune? And now it's coming alive. Every node, like I told you guys, would come out with new branches and flowers. Wow, these one are nice. These are the Cherimoya variety right here. You can see the graphenes right there. Here's another Cherimoya. Got some flowers here. Here's the Graph Union. I got them labeled, but just I don't know what they are right now. Here's my giant Gaffner with a bunch of flowers this time. Before I was getting one fruit one year, second year one fruit, and then this year I kept two branches and we'll see if I get more than one this year. That's the flower. See here, I would just pluck this one off so it doesn't take our energy away from the main branch. You know, these, these aren't gonna do any good. See all those? So I'm just gonna go ahead and pluck all of them off. And then just toss it in here. If you guys haven't uh, fertilized your tree yet, I already have. I did it last week. So for this uh, size tree, I did two bags of the uh, steer manure right there. And then I water it twice a week, Tuesday and uh, Friday, guys. So twice a week during the hot summer, okay? That's it, right now it's just waiting for flowers and pollinating. You don't have to fertilize again until the fruitlets, the fruitlets develop, you know? Cause that'll be uh, two to three months, two to three months after the initial fertilization. Let me see. Yeah, so it won't be until the next three months you'll fertilize again. And here I did the same to my longan. Fertilize, water every two weeks. It's looking good. This is the this is the Hawaiian variety. And here's my other one. Flowers everywhere, guys. Flowers up there, over there. Hopefully we'll get decent crop this year. Last year it was like five or 10. But hopefully we'll get some uh, See a lot of ants getting to work so hopefully a lot of fruit develops yeah so that's my april update everything is sprouting flowering.
So this is where the work begins, getting all these, getting all these flower to become fruit. All right, see, this one didn't make it, fell right off. All right, guys, we'll see you on the next video. Good luck on your Atamoya. Get that brush ready and start pollinating, okay? See you on the next video. Yo, that's cheating. That's cheating, baby. You gotta rake it in. Yeah. No, flip it. <laughs> That's cheating. Go. Right here, baby. Right here. You flip it. Flip it. See? Like that. Yeah. And say you scratch it. Scratch it? Yeah. Rake it. There you go. Rake it in. Uh oh. What happened? <laughs> you okay? Uh oh. There you go. I got it. That is your cake. Okay. Thank you. It's a cake.